How's it going everybody? This is Beat the Bush. This is the New Wave Induction Cooktop. It's actually really low profile and I like to put it on my dining table used for hot pots, especially since it's low profile. You can see your food better when you're sitting there. This is one of their more powerful one at 1800 watts so you can sear your steaks better. Today I'm going to do a comparison, a hot plate over here and boil two cups of water on each of these. We know induction cooktops are supposed to save energy because it transfers heat better. The way these guys works is it uses a magnetic field. It actually actually causes the pot itself to heat up rather than in this hot plate where it heats up the surface and then whatever touches it transfers the heat. So I'm going to boil two cups of water on each of these using the same pot making sure that the pot is the same temperature when I start and so let's try this out. 1000 watt hot plate here. Induction ready pot will show this induction ready logo over here. Put in two cups of water. Turn it up all the way max. Start the timer. It's consuming 860 watts right now. Let's see how long this takes. There you go. I think it's roughly boiling now. Eight minutes and seven seconds. You can set the induction to 900 watts, 1500 watts, or 1800 watts. I'm going to set it at 900 watts just to make it equivalent. The pot is cool. Put another two cups of water in here. Turn it on high sear. Start. Start the timer. 912 watts. So let's see how long this takes. Okay, four minutes and 30 seconds. These six buttons set the temperature to start it. Just press start. It begins at medium high, but you can set it to low. You see 100, 175, 275, 375, 425, and then sear just turns it on. If let's say you want 200 degrees, you set it on low and you can increase it to 200 if you want manually. If I just remove this, it will sense it and turn it off automatically, blinking the F. And if I put it back on, it'll be like, hey, something's on there, let's turn it back on. To turn it off, you push this pause clear button, just like that, it turns off. After you cook the top, it still feels a little hot, but it's not nearly as hot as the hot plate. To boil two cups of water with the same pot, it was eight minutes and eight seconds on the hot plate and four and a half minutes on this induction cooker. This is surprising to me. You're looking at using about half the energy to boil the same amount of water. Because cooking uses significant amounts of energy, this can add up quite quickly. If you guys are interested in this induction cooktop, check out my Amazon affiliate link down in the video description below. Thanks for watching this video. Until next time.